Fun fact, I'm an idiot. Don't believe me? Let me tell you about the time that I hacked my school's network and nearly got thrown in juvie. Back when this little glitch was in middle school, my school district was mostly running on older Windows 2000 and aging XP machines. Vista was on the horizon. Ah, Age of Empires 2 at lunch. Those were the good old days. Their sole IT guy didn't think too hard about security. Thankfully for the IT guy, a local college was willing to help us out with having internet service provided to my school. IT admins know where this is going. As a dumb kid, I thought it would be really cool to try sending messages to the other computers on the network by using the old netsend command. You could shoot little pop-up messages to specific computers on the network, as long as you knew their IP address or username. So, you know, netsend 127.0.0.1, in quotes, hello world. That would send a little message to myself on my own computer that says, hello world. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I had just learned how to use the asterisk or wildcard character. Uh, that stands for every possible value that could be in that character's space when you're sending a command somewhere. NetSend allowed you to use that in place of a destination address or username in your user group. Uh, so the wheels started turning in dumb kid ID's mind. So of course I typed, the matrix has you, as the message, and entered the destination as an asterisk. Ping! 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 ping. Just across the hall, I heard pings go off in every single room that had a computer. Every computer on the network was welcome to the Matrix in a wave of pop-up messages. Every single one. 30 minutes later, I was pulled out of class, thrown into the principal's office by the back of my shirt, tossed into a very hard plastic chair, had a finger pointed in my face, and was accused of hacking every single computer in the school. My principal was flanked by two very angry-looking police officers, ready to call it in and drag me away the moment he confirmed that I did it. As it turns out, the IT admin had lazily configured all of our machines to just appear as part of that library network at that college, meaning that I'd sent that message to eh, about 100 computers in total. No big deal, right? Also, none of these boomers had ever watched The Matrix. After I explained how I wasn't some kind of nefarious tech mastermind and telling the administration how the command worked, they let me show them what I did. I asked for the username of the principal secretary in the other room, crafted a message that showed them that it worked like this, and sent it. Ping. The principal, now less furious and more concerned, asked me if NetSend was installed on all of the computers on the network. I told him that this was a built-in command in Windows. Every single computer was capable of doing this, unless the command was restricted per user by a network admin. The IT guy standing right there was not very happy about this. I told them, you can Google it yourself. That's how I learned about it. Check my search history in the computer lab. It's right there. The IT admin was splitting bullets at this point. Hey, he, he's lying. I told you, I told you. He's hacked our network and installed that on every computer we own. We should have him arrested just in case he's gonna do it again. The principal wasn't buying it. ID, go back to class. Officers, you can leave. Admin, come with me. Needless to say, I wasn't booked on cyber crimes. I moved on with my life. The IT admin was let go from his position shortly afterwards, obviously, and he was replaced by a guy who actually cared about security and disabled NetSend on all user accounts besides administrator accounts. I got to know him a little bit, actually. He was nice. Uh, he helped to set me on the path that I'm still on today. Uh, VTubers. <laughs> and so, every once in a while, I mention this story to people who live around my hometown, and they ask, wait, you were that kid? I heard about that. That was you? Yep, that was me. I'm the guy that hacked my school network 